Since the beginning of time, man has strived to conquer the vast depths of the ocean, traversing it for commerce, scouring it for treasures lost, exploiting it for resources. But man also has strived to understand it, to transform its power for greater good, to protect it, and to help those who fell victim to its strength. For over 30 years, Resolve Marine Group has been a world leader in marine salvage, emergency response, wreck removal, and safety training. Working closely with the public and private sectors across the globe, Resolve is a trusted partner to teach, guide, and assist the world's maritime community. Started 1980-ish, 79, and uh, it's, it's been incredible. We've come a long way in, the, in this time period, working on the biggest jobs. It's just amazing. I went in the military at 18, became a Coast Guard uh, on an icebreaker. The dive helmet you see in the lobby, I started my diving in one of those. I was also a diesel engineer on the icebreaker, so when I got back out of the military after four years, guys came to me, would you like to join us in Europe and pick up this tug and be the chief engineer on it? I did that for a bit, and then they were selling the tugboat. A salvage job came up. I said, can I use the tug? And they said, sure. And then the second job came up two weeks later. I said, can I use the tug? And they said, yeah. And I said, well, I want to buy the tug from this job. And they said, OK. I resolved. I decided what I wanted to do. And that's where I came up with the name. US built up the response posture on the shores of America because of OPA 90 and now this is being followed worldwide. Uh, yes, you do not have a United States Coast Guard taking care of the worldwide maritime business, but they are set a very high standards of response in U.S. waters. Salvage and Marine firefighting requirements are 19 different requirements that must be met in every single port. And for our non-US flag clients, which is the majority of them, trading to the United States is a real regulatory risk because the Coast Guard has a lot of rules, the Coast Guard enforces those rules, so it's important for us to mitigate that regulatory risk down as much as possible for our clients. And we do that providing this robust network in every port in the United States for all 19 requirements from the first set of eyeballs on the dock to do an assessment to a full salvage plan being produced by naval architects and salvage masters and here in the office. We have invested heavily in making sure that we could develop these 22 depots across the United States, including Alaska, Guam, Hawaii, and Puerto Rico. And these 22 depots are not just a pump here or some firefighting equipment there. This is tailor-made equipment to meet our clients' requirements in the ports that they trade. And it's strategically positioned around the United States to be able to respond quickly where our clients need it to respond. With Resolve, the commitment is personal. From the top of the corporation to every salver that works for us, the commitment is to give the very best of one compliance coverage to our clients so they don't have to fear trading into the United States. They know we've got their backs. We build here what they need, where they needed big water pumps, huge water pumps. Uh, I started building one, and then we wound up building 10, and then we wound up building about 20. We're designed for any kind of weather, any season. The warehouses all have different aspects. They all have the same mission of having the assets ready to go when they're needed for a job. My role at Resolve is to travel around the U.S. all year round to make sure these depots are up to code, up to speed, and ready for quick response. We're working towards being a multi-tiered system where we can actually respond to a client and fit whatever needs, amounts, categories, and budget they require for that particular operation. This is just one warehouse of, of five at the moment, and, and we're growing. We're unable to find enough properly trained firefighters to do so, so we built our own facility and trained our own employees in shipboard firefighting. For the past 20 years, we've gone up to over 27,000 people trained. Last year was our highest year. We had 2,500 people we trained. 
Our training vessel we have in Fort Dale is a 140 foot four deck training vessel. We offer firefighting, hazard material training in there, damage control training. We're unique in the fact that we offer the ability to train to prevent incidents from happening, train for the incident itself to handle it, and train for the aftermath of the incident to take care of it afterwards. Most recently, we've built simulation facilities where we have now engine and bridge simulators and we train crew members in navigation and safety training. We have six large simulators and a couple of classroom simulator setups. Uh, we train everything from engine room management um, sort of operations to more detailed bridge operations, ship handling, um, electronic charts, so anything from sort of fine like down to single piece of equipment type of operations to full bridge team where we have captains and engineers all working together on, on combined simulations. Our real specialty, our niche, is creating customized courses for our client. The only way to grow in this business is to have assets all around the world so that if an emergency happens, you are there on site as soon as possible and be able to work with the owners to help them in their crisis time. Well, we have expanded internationally in the last five or six years uh, pretty dramatically. We keep equipment in Europe, we keep equipment in Asia, in addition to the equipment we have in North America. We recently expanded our capability to the Northern Pacific, the Great Circle Route, and we have a warehouse in Alaska. We have done some stellar wreck removals and playing some very important roles in many other wreck removals in the world. What differentiates Resolve from the rest of the company is our people. We are not distracted by anything. It's amazing to see Resolve's reputation when you get out in the field and start working with the maritime community. Resolve is a privately held company, not subject to shareholder desires, not subject to a board of directors decision-making process. Well, that's kind of one of the neat things about a small company like ours. Decisions can be made, agreements can be kept. We do have a unique business model. It's the people, but the innovativeness of the people. This is the kind of people we are.